Welcome, Namaste, and welcome to Dr. Shah's clinic. In yet another video, we're going to answer the question What is the normal sperm count for a man to be fertile? Now, as per the WHO 2010 Andrology Laboratory guideline values for semen analysis or semen processing, the reference range or the reference value for a, for a normal man you know, to achieve fertility or to father a child in the first year of marriage is sperm count is 15 million per ml. So, what's very important to note here is that you know, WH 2010 reference guideline values were basically derived from a study that was done on over, over 3,000 European men. And what they basically did was they looked at 3,000 men who were able to father a child within the first year of marriage. And they found that the mean average value of sperm concentration to father a child in the first year of marriage was roughly around 15 million per ml. What's also important and what's very important to know that when you take this value and apply it to Asian men, specifically Indian, especially to Indian men, their values can be slightly different. Now, we have seen natural conceptions at far lower, you know, far lower values of the sperm concentration. So, we have seen natural conceptions at values of 10 million per ml, 8 million per ml, 7 million per ml. Now, what's very interesting to uh, note here is that even at values that are, you know, at, you know, which are, which are, you know, far lesser than the WHO 2010 androgy laboratory guideline values, natural conceptions are actually, you know, possible, especially with respect to Indian men or Asian men. The problem is we don't have adequate data. We, we are not looking at a large number of people and we don't have a reference value for Indian men and so we are sticking to the WHO 2010 guideline values. Now, another important point to note or bear in mind is that the, uh, the 15 million per ml refers to the number of sperms per ml of semen. What's even more important is the total number of sperms in the ejaculate. So what is the total number of sperms in the ejaculate for a fertile man to father a child? That's 15 million per ml into 1.5 ml, that is the seven, so that is the seven volume, that's roughly about 22.5 million sperms per ejaculate. Is the cutoff value that's required to father a child in the first year of marriage. What's very important to note here is that sometimes a man may have 10 million per ml, but his semen volume may be 3 or 4 ml. So that means the total sperm count, is, the total number of sperms in his ejaculate will be uh, 30 million per ml which is still higher than the 22.5 million, you know, uh, cutoff value. So do not get worried if you see one or two reports, you, if you do a semen analysis and if you notice that one or two of your reports is showing slightly less sperm counts that are less than 15 million per ml. Say you see a report of 9 million or 10 million or 11 million. Don't get alarmed. Multiply the sperm concentration into the semen volume, which will be present usually at the top of the report and see if it is more than 22.5. That's the magical number. If it's more than 22.5, there's absolutely nothing to worry about there is a good chance of fathering a child in the first year of marriage. Mm -hmm. So what is the normal sperm count to be for a fertile man? Or what is the normal uh, sperm count for a fertile man, uh, you know, to father a child in the first year of marriage? The normal sperm count is usually 15 million per ml. But any value that is over 10 million per ml or any value in the range of say 10 million to 15 million per ml is completely okay for fertility. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope this video answered your question and you found this informative. Please comment, like and subscribe, share this video with all your friends and loved ones and um, I'll see you soon with another video. This is Dr. Shah. Welcome and Namaste. Yeah.